again. Let's set the lock. Five is the awkward one because five is obviously right at the back. And there you go, it's clicked in. Um, Pressing the pins up with the pick all the way along. I shall show you why that's happening. Right, I obviously need a, a different type of pick for this block. But I've not yet found a pick. They're all bouncing. No one's, no one's picked. It's picked by itself. Um, Lift it up and give it a tap and it drops down. Just not actually on the spring. Um, that one's the one. Now, that one rotated quite a long way, which I believe means that that one is a, um, a cotton wheel. Or I've got a cord up on a cotton wheel on another pin. And I can't get a pick in. Pin three is right there and it's stuck. See, I mean this pick is jammed in the door, and this is the this is the narrow pick. Um, it's just getting jammed up on the pins. It is actually pushing up on the pins. Now that's lifting, it's lifting the tension up. Now I've just taken the tension off, you see. Lost all my sets. Right. That's definite movement. Pin ones. Picked again. It's just picking by. It's just picking with this part here. It's, um, as I'm messing about with the other pins, it suddenly locks in. It's going all the way up, but it's gritty. Five is the awkward we're going to get to. This couple of times really, and each time it has been a little swine there. The front door there gives me very little time at all. Um, and as you see, don't pick locks that you use. Well, we don't really use this one, the only time we use it is with the deadlock on the inside. So, Drop down again, it's locked up now. This is where I find these picks are a little bit too thick because they're actually the same width as the keyway, just about. I put it like that, uh, you get very little movement, that's it, and that's where the pins are. So I'm going around that corner.
No, I'm no expert at all. There's a one. You see the pin, it's just stuck up there a little bit now. Pin one is lifting up and not dropping back down. Pin two is doing the same. Pin three is stuck. A little bit of movement. Now pin one swinging again. Nope. And two spinning again. And four. Right, I've picked it. <laughs> but for some reason, you've not been putting tension down. It's picked the other way. So. actually popped up instead of popping down. I don't know how that happened. Right, let's try it again. This time try and turn this way please. Pin one is sorted. Pin two needs a good dose of kicking up the ass. Go on, get in. Right. Pin three, pin four, click. Pin three. See, I know pin three is the key for this one as well. Right. It's just look. Locked up again. So I will be changing these locks by the way at some point now that I know how locks work. I will be modifying this lock and changing it here. Changing the pins, that's the back of the lock, that's where the key does not go. Feels like it's got more to give. Strong spring. One, two. One's up. One shouldn't be up. Let go. One's rattling. Just release the tension a little bit. And there you go. So I've picked the lock. Finally. Right, I'm going to show you this. I'll take the camera off its stand. Try not to stick my hands on the microphone too much. Right, I'm going to show you this lock. If it will uh, zoom out, thank you. And the lock is picked. Um, I'll show you the, the key way. Stand right back and zoom in. Okay, hopefully you can see that clearly. I'm going to release the tension. Lock it up again. Now, I'll show you what happens with my pick. The, um, the pins. Right, I'm just going to quickly show you um, the problems I have with the keyway on this. Which is why I think that these picks are a little bit too thick. We shall see. You can see I can lift pin 1 there. But you can see what sort of angle I'm having to go around. I'm have to go that angle. And once I get back to pin five, it gets jammed up in here. And you'll see. Get it off. You'll see that um, the the pick basically is 
getting caught on pin one and won't go around that corner very easily. I don't think I've already got this picked. It actually feels like it just wants to go. You see there, I'm caught on number five, but I'm not actually pressing on number five. What I'm doing is pressing on that bit there. Um, It would be nice if this would just pick like this. There we go. So, uh, click pin one again. So, that was a nice pick. Glad that worked.